boy Cassius. Bitch, I'm straight, I could die today. Yo, in good shape, run a mile today. Yo, I'm a pill, but I ain't wide away. All right, what's going on YouTube? Today I'm going to bring you guys a Destiny 2 video, a little different video from my Borderlands 3 videos, but today I'll be bringing you guys a Destiny 2 loot cave. I'm a little late to it. I'm sorry about that, but I know I've been gone for a while. I just want to say thank you guys so much for almost 100 subs. We were super close. If you guys are new, make sure to sub down below. We very much appreciate it. Yeah, let's get right into the video. All right. So how to get the loot cave to work is you must have shadow keep for this to work. What you guys want to do is you want to get a mission called risk rewarder. It is a mission that the Banshee will give you in the tower. What you guys want to do is you want to go to the tower, talk to Banshee, and you will have a quest called joy and suffering. You must complete step one to get to the loot cave. So step one with joy and suffering is pretty easy. All you have to do is one nightfall, one heroic public event, and one lost sector. Alright, so now that you've finished step one, you'll be given a new quest called Risk Over Reward. This quest is the one that you need for the loot cave. You'll want to load into the quest. It is in the bottom left of the EDZ. When you load in, it will tell you to kill three captains or something like that. I don't really remember, but they'll but they will keep on spawning even after you kill three of them. This is where the loot loot cave comes into play. As you can see in my gameplay. They just keep spawning and I just keep killing. It's pretty easy. And I pretty much only did this for about five minutes. So if you do this for like 30 minutes, an hour, two hours, seven hours, you can get a lot of legendary engrams. This could be very good for power leveling your character. So that's about it, man. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you guys did like, comment, subscribe, it would very much appreciate. Like I said in the beginning of the video, sorry I've been gone. I have I've been focusing a lot over on Twitch with my live streaming stuff. I've been streaming every single day for like eight hours. So if you guys want to head over there, twitch.tv slash outranked would be very much appreciated. Sub the channel if you guys are new, close to 100 subs, and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right.